Hello, this is Christopher with InMotion Hosting and a new video in our WooCommerce series. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do basic price editing for simple products in WooCommerce. This is an important function to get to after you have done your installation of the WooCommerce plugins and you started adding your products. If you haven't done that yet, I will have links in the description for the tutorial articles on how you can get that done. But assuming you've already installed WooCommerce and you've added some products, this video will show you how to edit prices. Before we get to editing the prices, I'll show you where you can verify your default currency. This would have been determined during the initial installation process, but if you're unsure, I can show you where you can find the currency options. Once you've logged into your WordPress dashboard, under WooCommerce, click Settings. Scroll down to the bottom until you find the currency options. You'll see my currency is set to US dollars. You can continue to use US dollars or whichever currency you require among many options you have here. WooCommerce products have a regular price and a sale price. The regular price appears by default and the sale price can be applied as needed. To edit these prices, just click on the products link on the left side panel here and select the product you're going to be editing. You'll see the price under the product data section under the general tab and you can put in any number for the regular price. You'll see here I have $11.99. And you can change this to anything you require. Below the regular price, you'll see the sale price. If you fill in a sale price here, you'll see the change reflected instantly in your shop. Basically, the sale price takes priority over the regular price. Now I've just set a sale price, so we'll switch over to the shop and you'll see how it looks different. We'll preview the changes. You can see the original price of the item is slashed out and the sale price is available. You can also schedule sales events. For example, if you want the product to go on sale this weekend, you can schedule it right from the product data sheet. Click the schedule link next to the sale price. Under the sale price, you'll now see the sale price dates. Clicking inside the from and to fields will pop up a calendar. Select the dates for your product sale here. and the sale price will replace the regular price only over those scheduled dates. Click Update and we'll preview that change. You'll see here the regular price has taken effect again, but if we come back on Saturday and Sunday, you'll see the sale price will be available. Now you know how to edit regular and sale prices in WooCommerce. In part two of this video, I'll show you how you can do price editing in bulk. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, you may like and subscribe below, and feel free to leave a comment if you have any questions. Did you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? It's something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.